The weather once again taking a turn for the worse this spring. Today's opponent, wind, and a lot of it, both on the softball and baseball diamond. We start with a pair of teams looking good to start the year. Minot rolling out the welcome mats in softball for Legacy. Majets enter the day a perfect 8-0 overall. The show no signs of slowing down early as Taylor Falcon gets great contact to right field. Just turns on the Jets safe at home for the inside the park home run. She triple later as well. Big start for the to the game keeps the Mad Jets rolling. Kirsten Galloway getting it done in the circle and at the plate this single scores the runner. Minot keeps its foot on the gas later. Tori Height send one that drops just in front of the first baseline on her way to a triple. The Jets get a huge win in game one and it's the same story in game two. Bismarck back at home take it on Jamestown. In the third inning, Demons up one nothing. But this pop-up by Katie Falk takes a journey due to the breeze, drops and right, ties this game up. Blue Jays now up 3-1. Bismarck looking to stop the bleeding. Isabel 40, though for Bismarck, able to grab the ball on the run, ending the inning. Demons at the plate. Runner on third. Jersey Berg grounds it to short, out at second, but she's too fast at first. A run comes home. Bismarck comes back to win game 1-6-3. Game two going to the Blue Jays, 14-3. Turtle Mountain up in the Magic City, meeting up with Mandan in a battle of the Braves. Mandan gets the bats fired up first. Jenna Wandler gets a good swing on this pitch to center to put her Braves on top. On the other side, Turtle Mountain gets ducks on the pond. Kayana Parisian with a big swing for a two RBI double as the ball slides under the fence. Mandan goes on to win big in the double counter. Sentry on the road in Williston winning 6-5 and 8-1 in the double header. Dickinson out in Watford City putting up a combined 44 runs in their two wins. 